All right. I know I'm a super huge wussy and everything, but that invisible enemy last time really just for some reason got the best of me and actually really freaked me the fuck out. And, uh, I, I really have no idea why. Locked. Need to find a key card. It wouldn't be a survival horror game if I didn't have to find a key card at some point. Ah, fudge. Yep, there he is. There's another one. I think he's behind me. Yeah, he totally is behind me. Come on, bud. Fuck me. Out of ammo. Ah, oh, god damn it. Ha. <sighs> Well, at least I got him. That's all that really matters. Alright, so I've... I have no ammo left at all. Shit. This really actually kind of sucks a little bit now. Hopefully that's gonna be the... What the fuck is that sound? Uh, oh, wait. I do. I have... Flash bolts. Okay. So, so at least if anybody comes after me, I can, um... Uh... Flash them. Not in, in the creepy way, but I can flash them and then... Uh, just sneak kill them. Because that actually is a pretty good way to deal with them. Please tell me there's not another one in here. And is there just like nothing in here? I would like a little bit of ammo or something. Ugh. <sighs> What was that? <sighs> How many? One, probably. One, yes. That is just amazing. I hear him. Get away from me, you fucking freak. Fuck. Gotcha, you son of a bitch. Okay, that was... At least I didn't take any damage. I know I wasted a shotgun bullet. And a... Uh... Yeah, so now I have no ammo left. But I, I know I wasted ammo there, but... At least now... I got rid of that son of a bitch. And another creepy doll. That's just great. Is there anything over here? I, ki I kind of looked at the archive or whatever, and um, it seems that there's like missing persons posters you can collect, and I don't think I found one yet, which means I'm either an idiot or something like that.
God, I really don't want there to be any more of those creepy bastards. I really, I really, I hate invisible enemies. I think it's a very cheap way to, like, garner scares and stuff. Cooley. That's what I needed. And that is also what I needed. I'll go ahead and use that shit now. Two. Wow. They're being really generous now. I know there's probably going to be something coming after me before I get to the uh, door, probably, I'm assuming, so... Yeah, say... Fuck me! Fuck me! Fuck you. Cause I don't I don't have any ammo now, so what am I supposed to do? I'm just gonna try to freaking bypass him completely. Great, another bathroom or something. I really need more ammo, like, miserably bad. Oh, great, this ass hat again. Please be more than one. Three. Awesome. Kind of. I'm gonna die. I am gonna die. Great. Creepy hallways. And I'm in a cell. Oh god. What the hell? Oh. Well, this is all very nice of you to give me doors, but I don't want it. Do... Do I have, like, a choice? Of where to go or something? Ah, shit. I might as well just try them one at a time. I'm gonna look around before I examine a dead fucking body. Cause I don't trust this shit at all. Is there anything? Nothing. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Wait, what? How am I s supposed to know, like, there wasn't anything that was... Whatever. Holy crap. That's not creepy. 
Yeah, I, th I think that that was actually the uh, scene from the... Uh, the uh, trailer with the... Uh, um, the scene from the trailer with like the traps and the puzzles or whatever. I, I think the trailer was... Um, at, maybe not called it, but it at least was themed with like traps and puzzles and uh if i'd press the wrong button there or any of these places i think i get uh fucking killed by big gigantic spikes <sighs> underground facility note he lies and to his own son his own flesh and blood it's outrageous gone to a better place that hypocrite that sanctimonious fool. I know the truth. I know him better than he knows himself. He's trying to punish me again. He always resented our closeness. He thinks he can use it against me. Does he take me for a fool? Laura is not dead. Well, about that, I don't know. Yeah, see, look at that shit on the ground there. I might die here. Ah, uh, just because of the fact that the last one had the left, I'm going to pick the right, and I'm probably going to die. Aw, oh, crap. That was pretty epic, though. I... Maybe I'm just not paying attention enough or something like that, but I don't see where I can even figure out the puzzle. And as I said, I, like, it could just be completely me not paying any attention, but... Okay, time to do this again. Let me, let me actually look around really quickly, because I want to see if... There are, is anything kind of explaining to me what I actually need to do here rather than just guessing. Um... I... I, I don't see it. I, I may just be dumb. Okay. And at least it isn't random each time or something like that. <laughs> Because that would be really shitty. Oh, I think... I think it is. It's the ones on the walls. Because on the wall... Um... You see there, there's the three. Let me take a look really quickly if... Yeah, because I picked the right one last time and... Okay. That's not really a puzzle, though, to be real. That's kind of more of just like not being a idiot and being able to differentiate like vi visuals okay so, sorry I uh I heard the like squishy sound and I and I normally attribute that squishy sound with the uh invisible enemies so I kind of like I ran around the table to try to avoid a invisible enemy which wasn't actually there so my apologies for looking like I'm I have no idea what I'm doing and just running around okay hmm assimilation of subjects consciousness initial symptoms sharp pain and brain stem at centered on insertion point Followed by gradual onset of hemorrhaging as capillaries dilate. Over time, degradation of the ego generates strong suicidal tendencies. They lose who they are and become clay, completely reshapeable in my image. But not me. Something keeps me from staying completely within. The evil within. Ow. Okay. Let me... It seems I have a lot now, so I'm pretty stoked to go upgrade once I get a chance to. 
Um. Ah, found it. That thingy. Somebody is seriously orgasming in my ears. Nothing? Okay. It should be this one. Yep. I knew it, I knew it, I knew it. Well, that is a bloody wall. Oh my god. Well, that wasn't in the slightest bit creepy. I swear. That is a big ass jar of green shit. Is there anything else around here? Come on, cardboard box. Snake is in there, I know it. Joseph. Why the fuck would you pull a random lever? I'm I'm pretty sure that in a death trap kind of thing, it that might have killed him. Hor horror game logic. Never. Thank God you're okay. I don't know what I am, but it's definitely not okay. You brought me here. <laughs> Jesus, what happened? My head feels like, like he's gonna die. You hear that? We need to get out of here. Can you move? Yeah, I. Joseph. Healing partners. I'm gonna look around just like really, really quickly because I really don't want to. I'm in bad shape. I need help. I know. Calm your tits, dude. I've still got a little fight left in me. Okay. Now can can you fight for me? <laughs> Alright, are, are we going? Is that what the deal is? Hit the computer, dude. Fuck technology. Fuck technology and it's gonna kill us and Y2K is still a threat. I promise. Okay. Let's get out of here fast. Okie dokie then. Oh, he can fight with me. Awesome. That is sick as penis. I'm just going to check this side door over here because I feel like it probably has optional content. Yeah, I'm gonna light you on fire, dude. My bad, but nothing. I guess I guess that's like the ultimate like fuck you to me. Nothing again? That's ammo. We'll take it. Oh my god. And the green juice. That scissorp, if you will. Oh, fuck yeah. Yes. Two this time? That is awesome.
And nothing again. Rad. But yeah, I don't know whether to be really scared or really happy that I just got all that ammo. Okay. Let's come on, Joseph Gordon-Levitt. That's an enemy. Oh shit, there's a lot of them. Keep your eyes peeled. Come on, light on fire. And now all of you are on fire, you bitches. Nope. Get away from me, get away from me, get away from me, get away from me. Now all of you get on fire. Aw, oh, you son of a bitch. I hope you get a venereal disease, you fucking asshole. Now you're on fire. I'm gonna pick up that ammo. Oh, really? You have got to be fucking kidding me. That is... What's the word I'm looking for? Bullshit. Big grade A bull caca. Really? All the way back here? That's much better. Come on, time to give you CPR. But secretly, I just want to kiss you. Let's get out of here fast. What I also think is a little bit ironic is that it, it is kind of like the stereotype of like the, uh, the grisly old detective and his clean-cut partner. Okay. I'm gonna go for the jump scare one first. What? Because I want ammo. Gimme. Gimme. Nothing. Gimme. And I don't think there's anything in this. Oh, yeah, there was. That grape drank. I don't even give a shit at this point. Okay. Now, if you don't help me this time, you fucking dickhead, I am going to shoot you myself. Oh, wait. Actually, you know what I can totally do? Since I barely ever fucking use these things. Come here. Oh, god damn it. Ha! He went boom. Keep your eyes peeled. No! Get back! And light on fire. Fuck! Shit! Light on fire. All of you. Die by fire. Oh, son of a bitch. You too, bud. Time to go. I know there's got to be ammo around here somewhere because they dropped ammo the first time that I killed them. Let me check back here. Oh, that is the greatest sight. Four? I am stoked. Oh, and even more. Hell yeah. I need my IV. It's filled with caffeine. For real, though. If I had the opportunity, I would get caffeine IV all day, every day. And even more, I am, I am so thankful. That's what I'm thankful for this Thanksgiving, is fucking ammo in medicine cabinets. <sighs> oh 
Okay, that is a flammable thing. So if anybody comes after me, I'm going to light them a blaze. Where did he go? There he is. Oh, God. This doesn't look good. Neither does that. Okay. It doesn't look like there are any immediate threats in here, and that is a very good thing, and... Oh, God damn you. Light on fire! Fuck you! Now, die by fire. And reload, Mr. Sebastian. Okay, I'm doing much better this time. And now I have a healing item, which I'm going to use. And hopefully more ammo, and yes, there is. I think I'm about stocked up on it. And a bolt will do. No shotgun ammo, though. Is there anything in there? Nothing. What's up there? Looks like someone's up there. Oh, it's just shadows. Shadow the Hedgehog. Shadow, nobody likes you. Get away. I may, I may or may not have mentioned it before, but a lot of people were complaining about the difficulty, and, and I definitely think that their checkpoint placement is a little bit wonky at times. And, and I think that that where, is where it really stems from, is just that the checkpoint placement is sometimes every minute and sometimes um, very few and far between. So... Oh, God. Why do we always have to go into the basement? That's what I want to know. Going into a creepy basement is never a good idea. And that door looks like it is ready to blow. Okay. No! Damn it! There might have been something cool there. This looks pretty sophisticated. I don't care, dude. Why would they put a bomb like this? Do you think we can get past it? Stand back. Let me see if I can disarm it. Let me guess. I'm going to probably have to like save him while he is disarming that and that's why they've been stockpiling me up on ammunition. Or maybe not. Let me tell you about my best friend. What is it with the sound? I thought it was something electric. Oh shit. Am I going to have to kill him? I am. No, not Joseph Gordon-Levitt. Oh, he's okay? I kind of thought it operated by like- Joseph, after Connolly, I thought, I don't know what came over me. I haven't been feeling well, but... Look, let's just get out of here. There's something wrong with this place. Yeah. <coughs> but what I was going to say is, uh, I kind of thought it operated by, like, zombie rules, where it's like, once you got it, you got it, you can't turn it on and off, but I guess... I'm fine. No need to worry. I don't trust you, dude. If you try to kill me again, I'm going to cap your ass.
Yes, ladders. Please nothing be creepy at the top of this. Please nothing be creepy at the top of this. Please nothing be creepy at the top of this. Yeah? The exit? F yeah. I can dig that shit. Oh, and bullets. And matches. And incendiary bolts. We need to move. And a safe room. that all about? Is he being interrogated? Something extra creepy is going on here. What the fuck? What the hell is going on here? Is it back to normal? Where did she go? Well, I can't even access the mirror, so something is messed up here. Okie dokie then. I am definitely going to do abilities. Shizen. Mm, I never know what to get. I'm like the worst person to shop with. Actually, you know what? Since I have a lot of ammo for this right now, I'm totally going to pick damage multiplier for that. And I mean, I, I do have a pretty good little bit of, like, stock on this stuff, but... Um... I think I'm gonna pick Syringe Recovery. Fire Rate, maybe? Hmm, what do I want to get? Oh, rad, actually. And I'm going to pick up the critical for the shotgun. something I need to do here. I'm just kind of confused. Is that her? Uh-oh. This looks like it's gonna be no. scary. No. Not that way. No. 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 Not that way. No. So many new admissions and not a single discharge. Let go of me! Let go of me! 
Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Well, about that. Okay, so now I'm back to normal. I, I guess I was supposed to go there first before upgrading, but... I don't operate by conventional standards. Okay. Cool, now I'm gonna go back. Oh wait, actually... Never mind. I wanna save.